Hello, hello, hello. Nope. Oh, stop. Out of the freaking cacti. <laughs> oh. Goodness. Who the heck that was? Might have been red, actually.
inroads. That was 19. That's two days ago. Got that outfit. Ooh, what was I thinking? Ugh. <clears throat> That's dumb. <clears throat> Tight. 
that's also dumb. Maybe nine.
All right. That'll do. It's a good way to get yourself shot sneaking up on somebody like that. Following you since Armadillo. Huh? I've been following you since Armadillo. I thought that was you that I passed coming in.
<clears throat> I don't know where anybody else is. Hmm. I took all my money out of the bank and bought two Lancasters. Oh, did you? Well, so I figure I'd extras. rather... Yeah, extras, and uh, if I get caught, I don't want them taking it. Hmm. That was almost eight hundred dollars. Well, yeah, it's, it's, that's about how much it cost. I'm just saying, if I got caught, I don't want the law taking my money. Oh, I see. What was your money in the bank? Some of it, yeah. So, so you don't have money in your hotel room anymore. No, I still do. I just can't put any more in there. Mm. We really need to go around and find somebody who wants to be a bank. What just ran up? What are you staring at? <clears throat> Nothing. Trying to decide what I want to do today. Interesting outfit on you. Does it look bad? Did I say that? Well, usually when you point something out, it's to make fun of it. What do you want, dog? I just noticed it was different. Saw a couple people at the uh, most colorful tents up there. Not just now, but on my way to Armadillo. Did you take the note down here? Uh, yeah, I meant to get another one. Actually, let's run to, um, let's run to Tumbleweed real quick. I meant to grab my book last time we were there to put a different one up there. Is there a particular reason you like going this way? Not really.
why the frick are we going this way? You did hear me say tumbleweed, right? Somebody was there earlier, barreled through with a wagon. And tumbling? Uh I thought you were wearing a different outfit when you passed me. I was. When did you change? When I come back here. Oh, so you came back here, changed, and then waited for me. Let's go check uh, telegrams, if you don't mind. Is my saddle loose? Yes. Oh my god, every time. Eleven, nothing. Do you have some secret admirer you're expecting something from? No, I'm talking about the other people. Our group. Maybe we can get more done today if there's not just two of us.
Freaking snakes. Go back to Ratskoa. I guess so. You're just not. You're not coming. That's where I come. <clears throat> who was that? Who was that lady that we used to run with back in the panhandle? Who used to uh, run with us on and off? Celia? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. A real flirtatious one. Yeah, that would be her. Wonder if she ever got word that we left the area. Maybe she did, maybe she didn't.
Is somebody messing with the horse over there? No. What the fuck? Why? It sounded like the horse was agitated. Oh, so my call.
I'll wait for a few more minutes for anybody to turn up. So does this outfit look bad or no? No. Okay. Is this tobacco? You pick this? Oh, you can't pick this? That freaking sucks. Hey, Red. Yes? Heads or tails? Fuck you, tails. <laughs> hey, hey, you won one. Finally. <clears throat> that must be freezing over if you won the game of that. That thing just tried to hit me. I think it went after me, but I got rid of the other one doing that. Mm. Ow. No! You stupid idiot.
Right. Who is it? So I'll keep playing this one. My bags turn red. You get him, you're intimidating enough. What? I said. My back is turned. You're intimidating enough. You deal with it. Who is it? Well, I was wondering who those horses belong to. That voice sounds familiar. Sounds very flirtatious, like. Hey. Well, hello it's there. Charlie. Speak of the devil. Well, well. And she does appear. I was beginning welcome, to wonder welcome. if you were, uh, if you ever found out that we left Texas. Well, I came here on a bit of a bet, I'll be honest. I remember you mentioning this place a long time ago and, um, hoped for the best, I suppose. Well, it's nice to see you. Hmm, it's good to see your beautiful faces. Well, mine, I'm not so sure about red, but... Sentiments there. Listen here, sugar tits. I think she'd some, win in a competition, some new but that's material every now and then. But hmm, you haven't changed a bit. Why would I do that? I've done so no well for myself, change. being who my, being who I am. Definitely not wanted or anything. Wanted. Mmm. Bad boy. I'm almost impressed. Yeah, I'm the I'm the only one out of this group that's wanted. Nobody else says their names. I'm not I'm sure wanted, they just haven't figured thing. it out yet. That that's that is a fair point. Actually, we're all wanted. Actually, they're probably more wanted than I am. They just don't know who they are. They don't know their names. And how do they know yours? Oh, because you <laughs> know me. I'm not... Charming Charlie. You know me. I'm not bashful to tell my name. I'm here no, to charm everyone in Saints Crossing. Hey, what listen. about the others? The the law that arrested me last time were pretty. Uh, I wouldn't say charm, but they uh, they definitely weren't disagreeable towards me. I'm not surprised. You know, just try and stay humble now and again. Uh, the Lucas and Damien are somewhere. Somewhere, as in you've met them, or you're still looking for them? Oh, we've met them. They just haven't telegrammed us today well looks like we have a full house then mm -hmm. if we you'll have me of course Ooh, i have to think about that one i'm just joking of course we will but i assume you are in desperate need of money how could you tell Oh, I'm looking at that cattleman on your hip and then the, the Kentucky Saddler there. They are <laughs> slightly disgusting. <laughs> you, uh, you partial to silver horses? I do love them. Okay, never mind then. We'll say I have a horse, but it's gold, it's not silver. Silver shines much better than gold, I'll tell you that now. Gold is too egotistical, you know, it's it's showing off far too much. We we gotta keep our appearances, you know, we gotta match. Match horses? 
the whole clothing, horses, everything. Oh, I, Why man, do you, you think definitely, the Arabian? You definitely don't match red. What do you talk about? You, you dress it in all. Actually, no, you have green on today. That's, that's fair, actually. Is there a dress code? Am I am I to wear certain colours? No, no. It's not gold. That's fine with me. All right. Uh let's see. Get you money. We could do um while we're waiting for the others, we could run a couple uh just some small moonshine things. I like the sound of that. Now, where do you want me? That's the question, because uh, I don't know how much work I feel like I am willing to do. But I do like moonshine. Don't worry, we'll, we'll do all the work and you'll get paid for it, just like usual. My job is looking pretty, okay? Those deputies come after us. I can do a hell of a lot better job than you can. Uh, no doubt about that. <laughs> All right. Anyways. Red, do you have any, uh, do you have any mash already or do we need to go get some? I got a few bottles left in the hotel. All right, let's go there then. I think my horse hates me. He'll be the first to hate me out of anyone I've met. I was about to say, I had the notion that nothing hated you. I suppose when you hear what happened to me, it's a bit of a different story, but we'll get there. There's a reason I'm here after all. Yeah, that's the reason we're here, too. He got too large. We had to split up. We, uh... Well, you know how we always like to rob those, uh... Payroll coach coaches. We try to, uh... We try to hit a payroll train. And, uh, little really? did we... Yeah, little did we know the, uh... They had Law scouting out the place, they expected us to hit it. We barely stepped foot inside the train before Law came riding up. Well, isn't that a shame? All that money. Maybe if we find some unlucky person, we'll get you some better guns. I do have a carbine, so you... Freaking snakes. Oh, hi. Don't blame the snake. Over here. Okay. What a lovely little town. I'll tell you what, if you want a hotel room to store your things, it's the best one here. It's $35 a week. Well, when I have $35, I'll take you up on that. <laughs> you will here in, a, here in a little bit. You probably don't have any rifle ammo for it, but it's something at least. Thank you. No problem, darling. How much did you have? I have 
ten bottles of mash. Oh, shoot, we're fine. Uh, let me go fix my saddle, because I assume it's loose. So every time I go into that hotel, some one of those locals comes and loosen my, loosens my saddle. Sure, they were trying to loosen more than just your saddle. Ah, I don't want anybody from Tumbleweed. Probably carrying diseases in that town. Well, you have to try something once in your life, right? It's not once. It's been a while since the last time I've done something like this, I'll be honest. Something illegal? Oh no. I've stolen a local's horse to get here. <laughs> As did I. They drop you off at that train station, don't give you anything. Exactly. I mean, what's a poor lady to do? I'm sure you flirted with whoever's horse that is, and they just gave it to you. Not sure if that counts as stealing. Well, I think he, uh, he broke the spell, started shooting at me. Ooh. I know. Might be losing your touch. Excuse me, fella. I'm like Cupid. I never lose my touch. <laughs> Let's go to, uh... <clears throat> we'll stop in Armadillo, check telegrams, and then we'll go to Thieves. And start working our way around the job board, see if we can find anything. That means nothing to me, but I trust your judgment. I don't know much of this uh, crossing, so. Well, we went all over the place here by now. Ah, Fred! Oh no! So wish. Blues today. I so wish I could blame that on you, Red. I don't think anything's ever Red's fault. I wouldn't go that far, but that was definitely the snake's fault. Mm, I'm waiting to see it. Red, do you want to tell uh, Sylvia about your favorite deputy? Oh, you mean Pinchable Cheeks in this? Pinchable Cheeks? Ooh, tell me more. I I'll <laughs> let you decide which cheeks I'm talking about. Hopefully both. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe even at the same time. A little extra. I do love tormenting deputies. Especially the key ones. I do want to find one. If we, if we can find one alone, that would be preferable. 
For what? Rob him or? Well, we, uh, we robbed the deputy the other day and we told him some information about a job that we're planning. Told him to take some notes on it. Take note of the information we gave him. I want to make sure they actually did it. Interesting. Well, you've never not been bold about your work, so... Can't say I'm surprised. You know, the way I figure is, uh... If I'm gonna be potentially facing a lot of time for stuff, I might as well just be upfront about it. They're gonna find out anyways. Loud and proud. This fog is... I can hardly see. Sometimes it's better that way. Yeah, if we were, this would be a perfect time to run away from somebody. <clears throat> Let me check telegrams. Let me give you both mine while we're here. Alright. Hello. Abby. Hello. My horse has jumped the fence. All right. What's the uh, telegram number? My telegram is New York 848. All righty. I can give you mine if you want since we're here. Mm hmm. It is the buns 291. Buns, Buns like Manius? <laughs> <laughs> Not Manius's, but same idea, yes. <laughs> What's yours, Red? Quiet Riot 653. I can't complain about any of those. Why do I have to go through this dirty pen for you? Oh. You should send it to the glue factory for such a crime. I would love to do that at my earliest convenience. What the world? What's I don't happening? Think that's I can't see that far. I don't know who that is. I don't think it's Law, though. Should we say hi? Could do. I need bandages now, though. After somebody ran into me. You have boobies. Aww. Do they hurt? Well, that's a shame. You shouldn't stop right in front of somebody. You should pay attention. I'm gonna stop here and get bands. Y'all can say hello to that group if you want to. We'll wait. Not too bad. Dusty. Of course. That's way worse than Valentine and Rhodes, I'll tell you that. Hi, V. Howdy. Y'all having a little. You? A little powwow over here. Yeah, I'm interviewing right now for goons. If you guys are interested in work. For what? <laughs> I'm trying to hire on a group of goons to do my, like, work for me. Oh, uh, goons. Mm. 
Goons. Yeah. Mm. Goons. It's a pretty good job. Uh, we got an ad up in the newspaper if you're interested in the benefits and everything. So, but I do have to go do uh, an no, interview uh, real quick with well, Gunslinger over there. Uh, oh, of course. No one holds you up. Uh, Once that one's done, if you guys want to pile in for an interview, it, one at a time, obviously. Um, uh, you know, there might be a future for you. Hey, Ralph's Bobble's your bitch, all right? Mm -hmm. It definitely sounds very interesting. Thank you. Thank you. I'll keep it in mind. Yeah, absolutely. It's in the newspaper. Okay, come on, guys. Mm. Nope. Hmm. Don't do anybody's work. Heads up. That's the one that said he was going to sign me up for fight night at Raskiller. That fella? A fight yeah. night? Now that's something I'm interested in. Oh yeah, rats go over there where you met us at. There's a, there's like a fighting ring, inside. Not that you would ever partake, of course. What is that supposed to mean? I I, I just don't think you'd do any type of work at all. Oh, wow. I do plenty of work. All right, it's so not you, the kind so, that you do. Oh, okay. So you're not gonna, you're not gonna give some moonshine to a fella. Don't worry, those wolves are down the cliff. I can, mm -hmm. if you ask me nicely. But the money's for you. We're not getting paid for it. I suppose maybe I can do it. Now, who do you think's the best wagon driver? That's my question. Uh, I can tell you who's not. Lucas. You. No, Lucas is terrible. You're the one that got it stuck in the river. The one time. I got stuck one time. Lucas almost had that wagon destroyed on the first drop off. I'm not surprised. He is something else that leads. And that, I got stuck in the water because the map told me to go that direction, but it wasn't even a body of water you could cross. Slow up a bit. I'm gonna see if there's any people doing chores by themselves. Ooh, that's a good shout. This is what we robbed the deputy the other day. What is this little ranch or something? Mm hmm. It's called McFarland's oh. Ranch. Not seen anybody though. You gotta be careful there. There's a cougar. Not the, Not the fun kind. It. Not the kind Charlie prefers. I don't prefer cougars, but I wouldn't say no. Well, they do both wear furry coats. Oh, we didn't go to thieves. Well, I don't know where we're going. It's this way. I just almost forgot about it. I can assume the name speaks for itself, right? Uh, as in that all the outlaws go there as a hideout? Yes. Hmm. I'd love to make some friends. Maybe more. <laughs> A 
Oh. That's a lot of horses. Who are they? That would be Law. Riding out in force. Wait, where'd Red go? Interesting. Where did Red go? Up in the tree somewhere, I bet. Red! Where are you? Dogs came out of nowhere. Yeah. I'm gonna go finish this one off. I could use some food if you fancy um, doing your magic. I actually don't have a hatchet, but I do have a stew I can give you. Thank you. Well, of course. Can you spoon feed it to me too? No, you'll have to do that bit yourself. For now. <clears throat> Where did she go? I would love to know. Maybe she just went on and didn't stop. Second option. Both in different directions. Jade Dragon one is closer. Or it's not closer, it's... This is not what I wanted to do. Oh, yeah. Hmm. The Jade Dragon one is farther away, but it pays more. Should we have her pick it up, or...? Do you want to go check, um... Tall trees real quick? Sure. Might be a better idea. Tall tree is interesting. These names really speak for themselves, don't they? Mm-hmm. But what if I told you all the trees were short? Might as well follow Red. She's going to take her own path anyways. What? They're definitely uh, making up for something there with that name. Brad, I was just saying we're just going to follow you because you're going to go your own way anyways.
say that. Average size. <laughs> Anything better? No. Oh. Mm, that one needs crates. Nothing better. Good lord. People must be scalping all the jobs from the from the job boards. You wanna just keep moving east? Maybe cattail? Caps? Okay. I can't say no to a good ride. And you can never say no to a good ride. <laughs> Charlie would say that. I have missed you, Charlie. <laughs> missed you too, Sylvia. I bet these woodlands are good for finding hunters. You said these woods would be good for finding hunters? Mmm, catch them out. Good. Three guns against one. There's a lot of, uh, creepy looking things in this forest, too. Like, people? Well, yeah, people on... that are skewered on spikes, pretty much, yes. Oh. oh how cozy. Perfect furnishings for my humble abode. Whoever lived there was very unlucky. Yep, very unlucky. They call that place Fort Riggs. Not much of a fort anymore. No. We do have a uh, job plan soon, if you're interested. Well, that depends. <coughs> it's a, uh, it'll be a pretty big withdrawal from mm. a, uh, from a bank. Well, that sounds just tasty. I'm sure if I'm around, I can make something happen. Get out the way, fella! I swear. You okay? Yes. Don't sulk, it's okay. Your face still looks pretty. Hey, Red, you got you got something right there. <laughs> Keep up, Charlie. I 
I always keep up. I got great stamina. <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> I'm not sure how you would know if I do or don't. I've heard your lady friends complain. <laughs> that mm. wasn't mine. Must have been Lucas. There's something called uh, hotel walls. They do tend to be very thin. Howdy. Hello. You think we can nab them? Um, good. Kind of far gone now. They wouldn't even. They they would not have even been able to ride away. Yeah, it's a little. It's a little too easy though. You think so? Yeah, exactly. They can't even ride away. They can't even. They're just stranded on the side of the road. I'd almost feel bad about it. Charlie Shang Mercy. How sweet. Compared to a lot of the gangs out here, I show a lot of mercy. These gangs out here will just kidnap and shoot whoever they want. Like a bunch of animals. Mm, shoot, no. Rob, well, that's just a little too fun. I don't know why Find I'm getting his off keepers. My... Really? Nothing. Nothing. Like, <sighs> there's one job left on that board, and it's gold bars. Mm hmm. I see. Everybody's out moonshining. The next stop is uh, Cumberland, I guess. Cumberland. Might as well keep going east. I like cucumbers. <laughs> Rider. Oh my goodness. No, I didn't run into that one. I actually gave you a warning too, unlike some people. You have eyes? I shouldn't have to warn you when there's someone in front of you. I wasn't talking about you, I was talking about red. It was a blind turn. I saw the rider. You just didn't. That's okay. The rider also turned into the me. World. We'll get him next time, sweetie. Rider. Take a sharp ride. Mm -hmm. Sharp ride. Was that another snake? Mm, maybe. There's a lot of snakes around here. wondered if you could use snake venom and turn it into alcohol. Be very careful around here. You need not sure why you would I'm not sure why you would drink that, but probably could. Some snake venom's known to be an aphrodisiac. Uh sure. Whatever language that is. It makes you want to fuck, Charlie. Oh, okay. And then you die, but... That'd probably be your ideal way to go out. I think it only works on men. Oh. That'd be, that's such a shame for you. I 
If I had male anatomy, I would be ruling the world by now. <laughs> I would be like you, but twice as hot. Hmm. You saying I'm ugly, Sylvia? I'm saying... I'm just that much more beautiful. Um, can't say I disagree with you. Well, thank you. Glad we're on the same page. Let's hope. Nothing. What in the world? Who was out here? At this rate, she's gonna see the whole entire crossing in one day. So much for work, I suppose. Oh, I bet you're so disappointed. What about the money? <laughs> we could go to Valentine's see if you can convince anybody there to give you money. I'm not a beggar. You just gotta charm them. Just like you charmed the fellow to give you uh, his horse. I mean, he shot at you afterwards, but it worked for for a little bit. I still don't quite know what came over him. Maybe there was a snake behind you and he was just trying to shoot it. That sounds right. Charlie, there's a wagon. I'm about to show you a new game I made up here in a second. Well, they were certainly aggressive. They have guns out? One of them did. Mm hmm. Only a pistol. Yeah, because that's going to do so much. This looks nice. Yeah, it's a very nice area. We're in the Grizzlies now. That was a bear. Uh, I didn't hear one. No, there might have been was, one. There, there was definitely a bear sounding creature back there. Yeah, it was across the pond from us. Hmm. Bears in this place. Yeah, there's bears up here. 
There's wolves and cougars. Oh my. Oh, great. As if people want enough trouble. It's all night. Watch the wild horses. Hello, horses. At this point, I almost just take whatever's here. If anything. How much did you say you- oh, no, never mind. It's all... crates. Mm. You may end up having to do a big one. How many did you have? When we need help. You have 50, right? I have 10 bottles of mash, so. 50. Yeah. We have enough to do this uh, big delivery one. That is uh, crates of 15 at 3 drop points, 187 per delivery. You got enough for a wagon and crates? Mm, yes. At in Valentine. Let's go to Valentine. Hopefully this is still here when we get here when we get back. So did you spend every penny you had, Red? Out of my bank, yeah. If we're doing this big job, me and Red are definitely getting a cut of it. But it's 187 it per drop off. Three people, that's 187 a person. Alright. Let's pick it up to a full gallop right. so we can get down back real quick. If we see uh, a local's wagon, I'm going to try to steal. Just make sure the fella doesn't shoot me. Hold Speaking up. of wagon. There you go. Just make sure this fella Ooh. doesn't shoot me. Ooh. Howdy. You mind if I borrow this? Jesus. That fucking wagon. Are you hurt? Oh, holy space. Am I right? We'll be out of these bandages sure. soon, though. All right. Hey, look at that. Got us a, we got us a nice big, nice big wagon. Mm -hmm. Look at that. With like 10 spaces worth of storage. Sylvia, you can take my fox shot if you want a faster horse for this.
This horse suits me much better than yours. You mean the horse suits you better than me? That's what I said. You said this horse suits me much better than yours. I had something else in mind. Mm. I'm gonna cut right here. Uh, why are we going to Valentine? We need to get packages to put the shot in. What did you say? Uh, there was a bunch of gunshots from that way. Hunter? I don't know, I saw... Are those wild horses? I saw a rider, but those wild horses running up there? Strange. Riders coming this way? I know. One rider coming this way, one rider going to town. That fella is saying I'm not getting robbed today. Put this put this little revolver out. His tiny little gun. Poor thing. I'll still need to go to the bank and get like $30 out. Unless somebody has $30 on them. I Not have 30. Me. Okay. This place looks like shit. It's because it's seventy percent is. Uh. I just think about something quickly. Mm-hmm. That's all we needed, right? Yeah.
want to hope these points aren't too spaced out. So this wagon's not going to be as fast. Let's hope we're not too obvious. I don't think uh, shiners usually take this kind of wagon, so... I do have to ask, if things go south and we happen to split up, is there somewhere in mind that we can meet? Uh, out here we usually meet at a place on the map called Window Rock. Okay. Or, uh, sure find it. if anything, just back at Rathskeller. I'm gonna go around this. You'd probably like uh, Window Rock more than you would Rathskeller. It's like that? an actual house with uh, rooms and things. Rathskeller oh, just has tents. Boy. Don't threaten me with a good time. Well, last time I was there, a shirtless man sang me lullabies. I hope he's there again. Otherwise, I'll make Charlie do it. You've never been afraid to take your shirt off, have you? Charlotte? Or me? No. That is your name, yes. Yes, that's my name. Don't get flustered now. We have work to do. So how do these work? You said there's locations. Yep, so we're gonna, we're gonna cook up this mash here to make shine, and then it's gonna give us three drop-off points where we're gonna deliver 15 shine to each. That's what these packages are for. Each package will hold 15. Okay. Oh, thank Is there someone waiting to give the, the packages to? Yeah, there'll be a there'll be a spot to take it to. No okay. one's gonna be sitting there waiting on it. It might be a little suspicious. I will warn you though, if one of the uh, if one of the drop off points are uh, a ranch cart hanging dog, they didn't take too kindly to us dropping stuff off there last time. Do you normally stay with the wagon, and then myself and Red will deliver the packages, or? Uh, no, not typically. Uh, sorry, I thought I heard wolves or something. Um, no, usually whoever's driving the wagon will be the one getting out and putting the packages in the, okay. in the spot. Basically, you and Red will just uh, 
kind of like protection, I guess. If only three law respond, then we'll see what we can do about it. If more law respond, then might not be much we can do. I might have to bail out the wagon and get up, you know, on the back of the horse with you or something and take off. Well, how exciting! I don't know if I've ever made shine. You might have to teach me sometime. It's pretty easy. I'm guessing you need some kind of grain, so if you show me where I can get that, then I can start stocking up for us. Mm -hmm. So you'll need uh, for one bottle of mash, you'll need 20 wheat and 25 sugar cubes. Um, and one bottle of mash makes five bottles of moonshine. I see, okay. Now these big jobs, uh, the one with the multiple drop points, they tend to... Eventually someone's going to spot us and report us to law. The ones with the multiple drop points, but the ones that are just, uh... You know, deliver ten, ten bottles to this location. It's not multiple drops, then... You know, no one really, no one really reports, it's not that big of a deal. And do you think the law know where we're going? They might. I gave I gave them a couple locations to get my time reduced last time I got arrested. Just depends. Depends where we end up going. Well, I suppose time behind bars with you is not the worst thing I could be doing. <laughs> I definitely have worse company. Like Lucas. Yeah. Ah, uh, you got all fifty. Not yet. Okay. I never knew you were such a chef, Red. Crossing's finest. Of course. Fifteen in a box, right? Yep. Be right back. That horse's name is Scoundrel, by the way. Scoundrel? I like him. This little sack of shit is called Roman. Oh, your horse? Mm. I can't wait to get rid of this fucker. You're on my horse right now. I was talking about Roman. Oh, you were saying this as in like you were, you were on him already. But okay. This. Right here. Scandal's pretty. Mm. No glue factory for you yet. Maybe later. Okay, 
nice show off. Don't compensate. I'm just being fidgety. I'm bored. Staying still for too long. Not long now. You can be patient. Let me know when you got this sewed up and I'll grab it. Is that all of them? Uh-huh. All right. Do you have any food by chance? Some bread. I have, like, one bread roll. Yeah, hold on. Thanks. Thank you. You're welcome. Alright. Oh, wagon's full. Looks like it's showtime. Sometimes it's like this. Uh, we got Roanoke, we got uh, Van Horn, and then uh, San Denis. Just outside of San Denis. San Denis? Mm hmm. San Denis. Oh, I hope there's a beach. I love the water. You should go up to the Calumet Ravine area. I've never been to Annisburg, but... You won't like the water there. Don't drink it, that's for sure. Well, I'm not thirsty yet. I just saw somebody take off down the road. They're probably about to tell law. Oh, great. I have a feeling that fellow was waiting on us. That was surprisingly fast. Probably hiding in a bush. Excuse me. Out the way. Be careful how close you get when you get in front of me because this wagon's very clunky to move. It's very big. Tell. We usually have like really small wagons that are a lot faster and easier to m maneuver. This thing's like t trying to turn a train. You hear him? He can't handle something big. I know, I'm disappointed, honestly. Ain't my job to handle something big. I would be a better wagon driver. I can definitely handle big things. One right.
What's the plan if we do run into law? Challenge them to a fist fight. That sounds like it'll go well. Yes. Oh, sharp left, sharp left. Tell if they're coming, I can't see anything. Let's hope they have lanterns or something. This depends on what the local said. If the if the local mentioned that one of the drop offs was near uh if they if the local mentioned that uh it's gonna be near Van Horn, they might not come. You do have 15 in each, right? 15, yes. Okay. I don't like Van Horn then, huh? No. It's a lot of gangs that run that place. Oh, and violent Friend. gangs. Okay. To Van Horn we go. Leap the way. I have plenty of time. Just trying to make sure I don't wreck this thing. Um, if I don't stay on the roads, the the wheels will start tearing up. And if a wheel falls mm -hmm. off, then we're screwed. Alright. I'm gonna be hanging to the left. I don't have too far to go, though. Nah, we got plenty of time now. Every time you make a drop-off, you just, uh, you get more time added to what you already had. Lovely. Very generous. Yeah, that fella said I would have about 20 minutes for this <laughs> this drop off to Van Horn. Let's go left. Watch the wagon, I gotta figure out where this drop off is.
One more. Okay. One to go. This one's going to be a longer journey. Well, the crossing is very pricey, from what I can see. It's pretty nice here. Nicer than some of the slums I've lived in. Well, what do you consider the slums? Well, I grew up in Northampton. Mm. I don't know anything about that place. remember is it smells all the time because it was full of factories mm. you'll hate where we're going then oh I can see it from here Ugh. It is sticky out here too, you're not the good kind. Mm-hmm. The moine. Watch out. Unfortunately, this is why you get uh, a lot of the ingredients. You see these uh, these crops to our right. I do. So that's the sugar cane that you'll have to pick to get sugar cubes. One sugar cane gives you two sugar cubes, but you'll need a mortar and pestle to grind it up. Or uh, sometimes I just buy sugar cubes from the store if it's just single things and not multi drop offs. Good to know. Obviously, though, if you buy the uh, the sugar from the store, you're taking a bit of a pay cut. Hmm. We'll see. I have gloves, so I won't completely ruin my hands. This certainly reminds me a lot of home. Mm-hmm. And not in a good way. Go on left. Left? I do like the look of these houses, though. I thought she would. If only there wasn't such a bad smell. I 
quick enough ads, perhaps. Oh. Hey, Red. Tell me who that is up there. In front of the wagons. That's a lot of people. I don't think that's law. But I'm not. We're going to be taking a ride anyways. Hey, Charlie. Mm hmm? Yes. We were just spotted by law. Were we? The one that was riding up behind us was one of the original ones we robbed. <laughs> Oops. Let's make this quick, then. I'm walking this back. I think they stopped on the bridge and looked at us again. They were definitely that, on that that's... bridge, the white horse. Yeah. Is it the say, ratter yeah. feather? The one with the green yes. shirt? Yes. He's one of the mm. ones that arrested me the first time. Oh, how did you get in? What? West Saint Denis. Oh, the fuck. How do you get in? I done? What? I'll do this. Down? What?
How am I supposed to get in there? When y'all go watch the package over there, this is in a very weird spot. I gotta find out how to get there. <laughs> it's right there, you see it? It's like in this really, like this little underground section. All these horses. Oh. Yeah, like it requires you to go through like water and things. And I was like, I'm not taking this package through that water. Oh my gosh, I went to go all the way around, ain't I? Oh, no, maybe not. There we go. I give my guitar. No, oh, oh shit, that going on. Okay. What? Okay, that's fine. Take me back over there, please. Oh no. Had to figure out how much to give her then. 374. Yep. About time. We had a bunch of riders ride out. Sorry, I was in a very strange spot. I would have had to, like, take it through water, and I was trying to find the other way around. You gave me nothing. <sighs> Alright, well... I'll have to, like, put it in your pockets then. Okay, come here. Any excuse to touch me? You know what? There you are. Ooh. I wouldn't complain about that. Oh, nope, didn't want to be up here. That's my horse now. Thank you. Where to? S stables, I guess. <laughs> I need my horse back. I don't get to keep him. No. This horse was a thousand dollars. It's a thousand dollars you can make. Might be able to buy yourself a better horse with that money. What do you think I should do first? Horse or gun? Ooh. Don't know. Probably could do both if you go for like a like a hundred dollar horse. Like some hundred dollar horses are pretty good. 
It's like a hundred dollar thoroughbreds. Hmm. I don't know. Take a look around. Let me have a look. I'm gonna go, uh, put what I have in the bank real quick. Do you care to wait for Oh, wait. Alright. Don't. She's still in there. Okay. And somebody just rode up to me and asked if I was doing all right. 
Ooh, who's being nosy? I don't know who it was, but I've never met him before. Hmm. But said they were going to Rhodes. Okay. That's kind of strange that they would tell you where they're going, but... That's what I thought. She told me I look like a fun person. Interesting. How's Law? Let's see if she actually got something. What the frick is that? That's the same horse? Yeah, it's the same horse. Couldn't find anything? This is Winter. Oh, it's just okay. It's a different horse. What kind of horse is that? Thoroughbred. Oh, good. There you go. Thoroughbreds are fast horses. I have uh, two hundred and seventy-three left, so possibly enough for a new gun. Maybe some binoculars or something. Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, what kind of? I mean, I'm using a Schofield. Red, what, are you using a Schofield as well, Red? I don't have a handgun. Oh, you don't have a handgun at all. I have that navy, but it's not on me. It's in my hotel room. Oh, I see. Um, yeah, Schofield's what I use. It's about like 160. We can go outside of town. You can test it out if you want. Hmm. Let's do that. Alright. Of course, as soon as I take, this ja take my jacket off, it's freaking raining. So that's my left. I thought that was my right. Well, you have to learn one day. Mm hmm. Bunch of law dogs. Mm hmm. Where did she say we're going for the gun? Uh, I was just going to go right here, side of town. Probably where these uh, tracks come, go across the water. Wait, t to where? Just, just right up here. Just where, get... where, where am I buying a gun? No, I thought you. Okay, I thought you said you wanted to test out the Schofield before you bought one. Oh, sorry. I can. Okay, I thought that's what. <laughs> I thought that's what you were saying. I mean, we can go buy you one if you want, if you don't want to test it out. I feel confident in knowing that you use one. Alright. Okay, then we have to go back into town. Oh, I thought you were... Just a little misunderstanding. Yeah, I thought you were agreeing to it. Okay, never mind. Alright. I actually met some of the uh, top pan folk up here. Once you run the gun store. Me and uh, Damien accidentally ran interrupted one of their meetings. Actually, while we're here... We can see how good you are at, uh, cracking safes. It's been a long time for me, but I can certainly try. I feel like I'm being pampered today, I'm so lucky. If you're better at it than Lucas, then you got one, something on him. I have a lot on Lucas, actually. He gave up trying to crack the safe last time. I don't know why, honestly. The safe is pretty easy, in my opinion. I just prefer to do negotiations. Of course you'd say that, mm -hmm. if you know how to do it. I told Red how to do it, and she did it faster than I did. 
Red's a natural. Right, we're going to hitch up inside of this uh, courtyard here. We are placed to have hitching post. Does anyone feel like praying today? Because I do like getting down on my knees. Goodness. Oh, it's good to be back. It's not good to have nowhere to hitch my fucking horse. There we go. Is this see how red we can make Charlie day? I think so. You take something one side, on the I'll ground the back other. Hmm? So was there something on the ground back here? I think my horse tripped on something here. What is this? Can't view hmm. the detail. Hmm. tell what exactly that is there's a crab out here a crab no a crowbar silly crowbar oh, okay i don't think there are crabs in the city darling well that's hence my surprise tone i would be too all right here's where you buy guns let's see Can you think of Schofield's better than a volcanic? That I forgot about that option actually. You could do volcanic. I don't really have first hand experience with it, but it's thirty dollars cheaper, that's all I need to know. And you get eight shots with it. Not that I need them. Fair. We don't use our weapons for jobs anyways. Not the big job we're playing in anyways. Mm. I'm excited. Do they not sell knives? I need a knife. Uh, no, that's probably the general store. Well, I need binoculars anyway, so we can go there next. Actually, I have <laughs> I have an extra pair of binoculars, actually. Just Aww. some tumbleweed. You were just waiting for me. That's cute. Sure was. It's actually a pair of deputies' binoculars. Even better. I can't wait to stare at the deputy through his own binoculars. Yeah, the only the only bad thing is that they're all the way in my hotel in Tumbleweed, but we'll go home later. It's fine. How lavish! Mm -hmm. Oh, is this a a tea bar? They knew I was coming. So here's a safe over here. Over the hair. <laughs> Let me get nice and comfortable. Ah, right, so the key to the key to the safe is what well, what you'll what you'll remember is left, right, left, three, two, one. Okay. So go if you want to go ahead and try and tell me what Okay. Tell me what number you start on whenever you uh start looking out there. Oh I I think I need to take my gloves off. Oh yeah. I'm 
What number did you start on? 44. Okay. So you're going to turn the knob left and pass the number 44 three times. Once you pass it the third time, you're going to start going slow and start listening for a different sounding click. Once you get to that click, whatever number that that is, you're going to spin the dial to the right and pass that number two times. Once you pass it the second time, you're going to start going slower, waiting for the other click. Once you reach that one, you'll... I spin. didn't hear a click. You said three times. Yeah, you, you, pass, you pass that number three times, and then once you pass it the third time, you're going to keep turning it until you hear a click. I, I'm not hearing a click. Give me a second. It's very, it's very subtle. It's not like, a, it's not really loud. You can kind of tell the difference in the in the clicks, but it's not like extremely different. That makes sense. Hmm. <laughs> You want to look over my shoulder and I'll show you. Okay, so I'm starting on 11. No, I'm sorry, that is 16. Wait. Two. Three. Did you need me start again? Yes, please. Okay. I'm ready now. I just wanted to yeah. look at you on your knees. Oh my ah. lord. Okay. Got seventy five. One. Two. Three. Okay, so it's six or four. One, two, I might have passed this third one. There we go. Stick a while. Did you see that? Did you hear, I the, did. Did you hear the different clicks? I did. Okay, that's what they sound like. Your voice is distracting me the first time, so. Sorry. Mm hmm. Mouth shut.
Hold on. I can't seem to get my hands on it anymore. Oh, there we go. Okay. Might have been saying too close. Okay, four. Twenty one. Sixty eight. you get your third number you just want to go back to zero i did it there we go oh beans at a fishing world see a safe cracking isn't that bad but lock pick it's a pain what's the difference You got bees flying around you. Now? You're good. So oh. are you. What? Am I good now? I think so. What are we saying, Red? Nope, you did it again. <clears throat> what about me? What were you saying about the lockpicks? Oh, um, to uh, you gotta go all the way to Strawberry to buy them and then come back here. How much are look picks? Ten dollars a pick. And then you come in here. Don't forget your jacket and oh. hat for leaving. I was showing her where the chest was. Oh, sorry. I thought you were walking out the door. No, it's on the other side of the counter here is where you try to lock pick. Ah. Oh exciting. Oh, does someone have water? That's what you could buy with the extra money is a canteen. Mm. Monoculus canteen. I might have some more to pocket away. Thank you. Thank 
you for that. Mm -hmm. I, it wasn't you. It was Red <laughs> who gave me the canteen. It's, no, it wouldn't. I gave it to you. <laughs> oh, well. I was just going to take it. Take no. your canteen back. Thank you. All right. I had Charlie cooties all over it anyway. We've technically kissed now. That's how it works. Well, you won't hear me complaining about it. No, of course not. Alright, uh, where do we want to go? Do we want to go hang out in a saloon somewhere? We need to go see if... Uh... General store first, and right. then... I don't mind a drink or two. Well, I don't drink, but I'll watch you all drink. It sounds... Very uh, uncomfortable. The watching you, can, you all you drink can stare or not at us. You can stare at us while we drink. Addy. Oh, give me one second, actually. Okay. I am definitely jumping on your horse at some point soon. Not intentionally. <laughs> Are you showing off again? No. Just now I get on my horse. Now where, where is this general store? This way. Uh, nice. Bit of a congestion here on the road. Hello. See you later, good looking. <laughs> oh, they're coming back for you. Is it here or the net? Uh, oh, it's here, right? Oh, it's back here, right? No, no. Uh oh. Which one of us you calling good looking? Both. Well, okay. Uh, wh what about what about this one right here? If I had to choose, it would have to be Shut you, the brown. Right. Okay, but I'm married. What about this one? I, I, if you, if you couldn't choose, it seems like mm. you don't have a choice. <laughs> well, I do like your suit. You're very handsome, so. Not the cologne. You like the cologne. You have I to get closer and one. smell up on him then. Oh, I can smell it from here. It's very, uh, very musky. Mm. <laughs> like you're a man of the, of the forest. Oh, a man of the forest. You hear that? That's, 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 that's that funny. That. <laughs> what's your what's, what's your name there, Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, wow, what's yours? You're the one who ran up on us, you know? And... You're the one who asked some questions. You compliment people you don't know. I mean, that takes a bold woman right there. You I like the mystery. It gets you somewhere. It gets you somewhere. Her I'll middle name is Bold. Bold. Bold with that. Sure as hell living up to the name then. You can call me Sly. Sly. Sly or Slay? Sly. 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 Come now, Cal. Sly, Bold. What's your last name there? <laughs> Mysterious. I'd like to think Charming. Charming. Well, Miss Charmin, nice to meet you there. Why don't you two, uh, why don't you two flatterers exchange telegrams and maybe you can get to know each other more on a, on a personal account there. Maybe <laughs> over a game of craps at the boat there. Mm, Some point. Perhaps. You give me yours, I'll send you a telegram. There are friends. <laughs> T.S. as in the Look at these. The way love works is truly a, a mysterious thing. It just happens sometimes. It's like, uh, you know, two Where's birds meeting thing? in the air. So generous. Well, yeah, these things are just, you know, just can't be hell. never got your name. Can't be hell, indeed. Fate.
Fight. Yeah, exactly. Don't I mean, I believe in spinning fate. I believe in, 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 in dealing with it. I believe in trusting it. And I believe oh, in respecting it. You know? I, I think a lot of things. I don't expect a telegram very soon. Just mm hmm. Seems that way. You're done with seducing her? Yeah, there we go. Nice. <laughs> Y'all have a safe, fun, and safe night tonight, alright? Goodbye, Slime. That we will. Oh, it's too fun. Well, I was calling y'all lovebirds. Love? <laughs> Disgusting. That's what I was thinking. I just agreed with them and then, but really I was like, this fellow will be lucky if he even gets a telegram. There's a reason I took his and not the other way around. Mm-hmm. Nice general star. I don't know why Here's I came the in man here. in the brown. Oh, you're protecting me. Or not. I'm still standing right here. You went very silent. Hmm. What do I need? One of these. You'll probably want a canteen. Um, let me see. Knife. Don't forget your knife. I got my knife, I got binoculars, I got some rope for later, um, and I got a mortar and pestle. There you go. I don't think I need anything else. Maybe a shovel for hiding the bodies. Yeah, that fellow that you just got his telegram for. Uh, if it was the man in the brown, I would have swallowed him up. Unfortunately, he has morals. Unfortunately. Fortunately, I do not. Where did Red go? I don't know. She just tends to disappear. She's coming around the corner behind us there. So I do need to go to a bank to put the leftovers away. And then Tavern? Sure. Yeah. Do we want to go? Oh, okay. My porch has a mind of its own. Do we want to go to Rhodes Paw the house or Blackwater? I haven't seen that either, so. They're both pretty yeah, nice. good with me. I think you might like the part of the house, though. I'm just trying to think of which one's more likely to have people in it. Valentine's Saloon is pretty crowded most of the time, but who wants to go to Valentine's Place? It's disgusting. From the little I saw, definitely not me. We'll go to a bank here. Okay. All right. We'll go to Rhodes and see if uh, there's anybody there. If not, we can go to Blackwater. Yeah, 
It does feel good to have money in the bank again. Although the sooner I get a hotel, the sooner I can't get fined. Mm -hmm. This horse is much better. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I figured it would be. Now what was that Ooh. about? I don't know. I just now saw the people in the in the building. Oh, there were people in the building too? Mm-hmm. Must be having a bit of a standoff. And we rode right through it. Yep. Good thing no shots were going. I thought they were waiting for us. I was going to be excited. What a shame. I would have been a little surprised, actually. <laughs> for Robin well, one day. Considering deputy. I've not served time for Robin one of them back there. Yeah. Honestly, that wasn't even the fellow we robbed. He was just there. He was in the vicinity. Oh, I didn't. I gotta tell you about that plan. We, uh, me, Red, and somebody else who, uh, did a couple jobs with us one day, we, uh, we stole a wagon and then, um, pretended like we crashed it on the side of the road. And I was laying on the ground while Red and, um, the other lady, Flynn, was hiding in a bush. And two deputies rode up and they popped out of the bush and we held them at gunpoint. <laughs> Oh, what fun. I wish I could have been there. Oh, yes. So, this is Rhodes. Mm hmm. This is the parlor house right here. See if anybody's inside. Doesn't look like it. It does look quiet. Beat you to it. Ain't nobody in here. Not uh. a cell. Might grab a bath upstairs, though. Ooh, a bath. Can I join you? <laughs> if you want to. I didn't hear mm -hmm. any help. Okay. It's a lot of horses. That's a lot of horses. Mm hmm. Bath time. <laughs> I hope you know I wasn't kidding. I didn't think you were. I have to say, you do look so cute with a ponytail. Well, thank you. At a girl while I was in Cisco. That's the jail. That's here. I heard you went there. Mm hmm. They, uh. Naughty, naughty. Yeah, we, uh. 
They got me for, let's see, a moonshine run. They got me for robbing a deputy and then another armed robbery. They, uh, they chased us when we were doing a big moonshine run. And uh, I stopped the horse. I stopped my horse uh, while the others kept going. And they uh, they asked me who I was, and I told them my name. They're like, oh, okay, you're the, you're who we were looking for, anyways. And they just let the others go. Well, that's nice of them. How's the water? It's nice and warm. Let me uh, I'll go ahead and hop out of here. She so still have some warm water. Oh, thank you. Very considerate. Mm -hmm. Are you shy? I think you'll find there's not much that uh, stays underwater, so... Um, definitely is not. Is Silva your natural hair color? No, I suppose. When I was younger, I had uh, more blondy brown. Hmm. Not really sure what happened, but after a certain point, it just started going grey. Hmm. I've embraced it. I think it makes me look unique. You know? It definitely does. Maybe it's the, uh, maybe it was the stress of always being the most beautiful woman in the room. Oh, it does get to you. Oh, we've made red weight long enough. <laughs> Any longer she think we're doing something we shouldn't be? Not sure if the word shouldn't is correct, but... Not when we have company. Don't be rude. Don't tempt me with cards. And the uh, that's why I said roads are black or uh, black water. They both have blackjack, but the one oh perfect. Uh, the uh, saloon and black waters uh, has a more expensive buy-in. Red, did you see? Did you see the big group of horses that came in? There's a lot of them. All right. We can bathe together too, Red. <laughs> if that's what the problem is. You made her faint. I think so. What a shame. Hello, Red. So you two missed a lot of law riding in and out of town. That's what I was. That's what I was asking. Apparently, had uh, dust in your ears. I was asking if he saw the big group of riders. I left three of them at the office. Hmm. Interesting. Related to that stakeout, maybe. Possibly. I would say so, probably. Maybe. Do we want to go to Blackwater to see if anybody's there? Yeah, why not? Let's 
do that then. I don't know who this little geezer is. Give me a moment. Okay. Remind me to load my gun when we get out of town. Sure, well. Can't be having an unpacked pistol. Oh, it's very detrimental. It's very inconvenient when you leave it. You know it's bad when you shoot blanks? Mm-hmm. Well, I wouldn't know, but... No, same. you wouldn't know. You know, you still have your youth about you. Yeah, I'm like that geezer that just walked in. <laughs> Part of me's hoping it's the fella who was running his mouth whenever they uh, transported me to San Denis to ship me off to Cisco. Some old fella was yelling stuff like, uh, don't do crime if you can't do the time, or something along those lines. Uh. As, he was, as he was standing by the telegram station, far away. I told myself, if I ever find that fella, I'm going to whip him upside the head with my pistol. I hate rude people. People that don't mind their business. You and me both. Oh, there goes his horse. Looks like he didn't want to say hi. He's down there. Okay. I don't bite most of the time. You good? Yeah, I'm good. All right. Uh, just need Black a water. There. All right. Black water it is. Is the water black in black water? It's actually black. very, uh, it's very brown, I guess, on black water. It's very dusty there. Is it everywhere dusty? Yeah, it's dusty here. It's just a different color dust. There's like red dust that sticks to your clothing here. It's really bad. It's disgusting. I hate it. What did you name your horse? Winter. Oh, that's right, you said that. Glad you pay attention. Mm -hmm. Most of the time. My mind goes a mile a minute. I haven't been able to find any of those uh, herb cigarettes that I used to smoke all the time. I'm sure we can find something. Go the other oh. way. Scram. Your horse is real clingy. <laughs> My turn to drink now. I'm gonna check my telegrams real quick.
I do like the look of these fields. They're not terrible. Yeah, this area of the crossings are very green. <clears throat> I feel like red is camouflaging with the crossing. Mm -hmm. Down there to our left, oh, and there'll be more of it as we continue on, but there's a little beachy area. I do like the beach. It's nothing better than a swim at night. Have you ever swam naked in a lake at night? Swam? Um, probably. More so, probably bathe and then swam around a little, probably not for the sole purpose of swimming. It's a fun experience. Maybe you have freeing. to show me. Oh. Maybe. Now that to our left is a perfect spot. With the island in the dock. That's you a perfect just jump spot. Right in. Yeah. I like that place. I am gonna make a note to go back there. There's another snake on the beach, because why not? They really seem to like you. Yeah. I do have my experience with snakes. Really, no? Yeah. You're a, you're a snake wrangler. No, it's more so talking about snakes as in like the people. People betraying me. I think we all know that one a little too well. Like I said, there's a reason I'm here. Mm hmm You'll have to dive into that reason one of these days. Oh, she went this way. Maybe when it's a little little less roll. It's still still quite fresh at the moment. Right. Are there trains? Regular yes. trains? Yeah, typically. Oh, fun! This view they'll is have, crazy. Uh, they'll have party trains and stuff too. We once saw party a train. Trains. We once saw a train in uh, Armadillo that had like a piano and everything in it, a bar. I need to get myself on one of those. You know, actually, that's a good idea. Maybe we... Hmm. I have to run that by the rest of... I have to run that by everybody else. Maybe after this, uh, this first job that we're doing, maybe we'll rent one in advance. Assuming, you know, that we pull it off, which we probably will. But as, like, a celebration. That would be fun. Wet. Okay. Oh, so much for that bath, I guess. <laughs> you get snakes. I'm gonna shoot every last one of them. Doesn't seem like there's enough ammo in the world, though, to kill all the snakes that are in this freaking place. I wish there was. 
The world would be so much more peaceful without snakes. Mm-hmm. I got a telegram. You can keep following right to the Sloan if you want. Okay. Fuck. Wrong button. Pardon me. Sorry, ma'am. Who steals cream and how? Well, uh, by by gunpoint and uh, cream quality. You must have some really good cream. We have the best cream in the crossing. Best in the crossing. I mean, if it tastes as good as you guys look, then I'm I'm sold. Yeah, we try to keep up the standard. Very impressed, very impressed. Gonna get anything, any of your companions something? I'll take a stew. If you don't mind. They do have the best beans. You should try their beans. Stew will be just fine for me. High quality beans too, and coming your way. If you're unaware, it is happy hour, and happy hour is free. As long as you let me know what you want, we can uh, we can serve it up. Assuming it's I would top. love a whiskey. Certainly. Would you like that in a bottle of glass? Ooh. Do you have ice? Shaved. Whatever form ice tends to come in down here. I'll serve you up a little bit then. You know, I want to. Kind of give you a kind of a slurry of a whiskey. Oh, I'm excited. I haven't drank in at least six hours. You enjoy that drink, then? Oh, I will. Thank you. Howdy. Yeah, thank you. Howdy. So you, uh, you folks want to be interested in rumors around town, would you? I take you have a gambling... In rumors? Rumors mm. around town. Is that what we pay for rumors around town? No, no, no. I'm, I'm more than happy to gossip. Well, I don't know any rumors. Well, I had a... Uh, well, if interested, I had a uh, fella come in a couple of weeks ago. Well, probably over a month now claiming that he had went and buried 90 treasure locations all over the cross and said he spent about 30 40 thousand doing it there must be some That's worldly treasures money. that have got buried out there that's so is there any validity to this 
Well, there was a fellow that came in there, uh, what, uh, about a week or two after the fact, saying that he had found uh, like a whole, like a whole, like one of those whole treasure boxes full of gold bars. Hmm. But how do you find the treasure? Do you have a map or? Well, I think or, uh, the, the standard of finding any kind of treasure in the crossing is uh, using a metal detector and a shovel. Oh, finding people that may, that may have found it before to give you kind of clues or hints. I hear that a lot of people up in culture have found a couple of them. Interesting. Who has that source of money? You know, all of this treasure. Who who would this person be? Probably a pretty good treasure hunter. Eddie. Hello. Howdy, Eddie. I would imagine it would take a uh Eddie Masterson. I, I'd imagine it'd take the best treasure hunting hunter in the crossing to be able to pick such good spots. Sounds a bit right. Hmm, only the best. I didn't know there'd be treasure in the crossing. Yeah, well, I mean, uh, nowadays is you know it's almost hard not to find treasure. You could uh, walk the fields and fucking k kick your toe, and you look down and just some gold. They're from hmm. some criminals riding off with a bank job. They just had to dump their loot. Never really know. Now that does oh, sound interesting. Hey, sir, can we get you anything? I'll take a stew and a whiskey. Got it? I'll set you up with a stew to start with, and then we'll get you a, we'll fetch you a whiskey. Sure. Sure. How are you doing? Are you in the yourself? Are you, uh, you ready for the cow drive today? I sure am. Uh, I was also wondering Fantastic. if I could get a bottle of gin, by the way. Yeah, yeah I can sort that out for you. Do you have a preference on the uh, the gin? Uh, laundry gin, if you please. Makes sense they'd find you in the saloon, huh? Yeah. Pick you for so a who is day. this? Thank you very kindly. We should uh, catch up. What do you say? Hey, me and you. Been a while. I was told an old face show, though. No, you're kidding. Your face don't look too old. But that's what My hair may be gray, but I'm not old. I didn't say it. He did. Did you really? I meant old as in like from the past. Yeah, that's the thing about interpretation, you know, people get it wrong. Oh, from the conversations we've had, you seem to uh, enjoy older women, so maybe old for you is a compliment. <laughs> Take it out. A young, are them. <laughs> young man like himself. Cougars, really? I think anything to this boy is a cougar. Oh, Martha, did you miss the uh, bank robbery and the saloon robbery just before? Oh, uh, really? A saloon robbery? Mm -hmm. They came in here and robbed the place? Well, I'm damned. Well, Didn't no, expect no, you to that, show up. That... The, the bank robbery actually when it ended up being prong and it's good to see you how are you you know leave down oh you know and we same old and same old that motherfucker robbery stole my canteen was. though <laughs> awkwardly skirted around there's little the things to steal from. a canteen oh i offered him a job actually he stole my guns too but he gave them back once i uh well, then, what I do for you know, I feel like that's just how it's been. Oh, I feel like that's how it works cream. with the outlaws around here. You, they find out that you're also an outlaw, and then they just well, I, I he was a, a solo man. I, I may have offered him a spot in your job, cock eyed, bullshit, cat assed, fucking not super impressed. Yeah, you tell him. You have a lovely day, sir. Must have been playing blackjack. An interesting Bro. fellow. I thought he looked I at he himself in the mirror. Playing blackjack. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he'd be in such a bad mood if that was the case, though. I thought oh, he just looked at himself These in the mirror. Black, these blackjack dealers cheat. I'm gonna say. 
<laughs> you think so? I mean, I know it's so. been up there for a while. And he stormed out, you know. No, Red's up there. Oh, right maybe now. he was talking about yeah, Red. She, Who she, knows? She's been, she's been up there for, for a while. She's probably lost it all. Either way, I, I did offer this man a job because... Uh, wasn't super impressed by the way that he went about robbing me, but we can always use an expendable hand. Mm -hmm. Slaying jumps so, now, look so, at you. Yeah. I'm almost impressed. Almost. Almost. I'm not impressed by you. I found you in the saloon of all places. That just is very... I, I do my best like business it? in saloons, okay? Waiting for the cattle drive. Besides, you are always impressed by me. You Enjoy just don't want the, to admit uh, it. Interesting people and that's fine. You, you have one of those two, Ron. So, uh, Luke, I know you had the idea of robbing this plant bank and doing the boat, but Red and I tested it out, and they could pretty much follow us all the way along the shoreline and just get us as soon as we get mm -hmm. off the boat. That's fair. Yeah. That's fair. I did but, consider it. I just I haven't tested it yet. That makes sense. Yeah, we tested it the other day, but... We have a alternate plan for Valentine that we can show you. Okay. Which business? Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm interested. Mm -hmm. I, am, I am. Well, what's the plan here? Well, we're going to see if Red loses all of her money. How's it going, Red? You lose it all yet? Fuck you, kid. Uh, you know, I'm actually very good at Blackjack. I bet I can win it all back right here. All right, heads. Well Head really? says she did. Tail says she did. Oh, it's still warm. Oh, she did. At least I lasted longer than the professional gambler that was sitting next to me. I'm very <laughs> glad you have the ability to last long. Now I'm going to kill this man. <laughs> I wouldn't say that too loud. Well, that's unfortunate. Blackjack, I'm here. Never mind. I win. Sometimes I like to think it's the seat you sit in. You need a lucky seat. I have a lucky seat right here. I feel it. I'm going all in right away. Is it because Red's ass has been there? You think it's lucky now? Oh, I didn't say that, but you sure. Wow. Is your... How, what do you think, Red? Do, do you think the seat's lucky all of a sudden? <clears throat> yeah, we're about to punch. You know what? You son of a bitch. Go ahead. Sorry. That chair is lucky that I sat there, yes. I know certain people that'll be jealous, including the ones by the left. Oh, very. I'm a perfectly good chair. Oh. Huh. This is a terrible, terrible place to be. Yeah, I just don't feel comfortable staying here. <laughs> you, son of, you son of a bitch. Um... We'll stay. We'll stay. The smart move is to stay. Wouldn't it be crazy if I hit a 21 off of a 17? You would, but you won't. Oh, you... <laughs> yeah, that was, that was dumb from the beginning. Oh, you son of a bitch. He had me beat anyways, it's fine. Nothing wrong with spending some pocket change. I don't know, I I've spent almost $500 on lockpicks in the last two days. Uh, well, uh... Fun. Let's go show, yeah, you, the, uh, let's go show you the plan that's going to get us more money. Okay. Our new skill? Can be expensive.
At least you didn't go for, you know, elephant wrestling or something. Good night, gentlemen. Elephant wrestling. Good night. Sounds about hard on the trunks. I'll show you a trunk. I think that goes the other way around. I think so. Mm. I'm sensing a theme here. Oh, white horses? Grey horses, I guess. Grey is right. Can make it. And I, I don't think a lot of the law here, too. What road? You talking about this bridge up love, here? I would love I to see you try. Make this jump. We, uh, had a chase I'll tell you what, you try it. You go for it. What Show us what you made of, Lucas. I dare you. You try it, and then if you make it, I'll try it. I bet I could. Okay. All right. Just gonna do that first time. I think the key is you don't want to go. You don't want to go real fast. I think that's the key. I think that's the key. I think we can get a lot of law this way if you ask me. We just uh, we just sit here on the other side, just just waving at them. Oh, I think we'd have plenty of time, and then we could even get away too. Oh, she's too slow. We gotta speed it up. Hold on, hold on, I can't hear you. What'd you say? I said, is it my turn now? I guess so, or you can go around. I hear guns, gunshots. I don't hear gunshots? that. Maybe it might be, might be wolves on, on top. Go, go check it out, it might be red beam attacked by wolves. I didn't hear them. Which direction did they come from? Wait, oh, yeah, I just saw something riding this way. Oh, I just saw a horse run. Yep, there's Red's horse. I see wolves. That's red, okay. Shitting. Well, there we are. Who's hungry for wolf? I don't have a hatchet. Does anybody have a hatchet? No. Um, I, I did. It's in my bank right now. What the world? Jesus! What happened? You okay? It went so fast. It just went right out from underneath her. 
Is there more wolves? I don't think so. I don't hear any wolves out there. Yeah, I don't see anything. Let's just get out of here. I mean... So that bridge actually isn't a terrible idea. You just can't go full gallop. I think that's the trick. That's probably what that's probably where a lot of people go wrong. They try to go full gallop thinking they have to do it. Make the gap. No, I worry. The last thing I want is my, is my horse breaking its legs. Or me breaking my legs. What's your gun out for? Are you scared? There's some wolves through this area. Are you scared of some wolves? No, I just don't want to be caught off guard from them. Howdy. Hello. Oh, let me reload my gun. Yeah, probably should do that. Thank you for reminding me. Yeah, I just did. You're welcome. Sharp right. Sharp right. Okay. I have no idea where we are. But it all just looks the same to me. Mm-hmm. What did who? Huh? This I, place I, is I called know. Painted Sky. It's what this ranch right here Painted is called. Painted Sky. That is a good question. Where are we? Where are we going? Valentine. Oh, okay. okay. I'm gonna show y'all the uh, the plan. Well, Red already Why knows the, it. Where's the plan of Valentine? Yeah. And I've that's, been wrong. That's the bank. Stuff. That's where the bank is. That. There's lots of folk there too. And lots of disgusting little. Oh no, you're just disgusting. I think Rhodes is maybe my town. Picturesque, perfect for a beautiful lady like me. Whoa there. Sorry, I was laughing too much. Valentine can be uh, Valentine can be picturesque if you you know if you're standing far away squinting your eyes. I've heard people describe you the same way. Are you talking about Rhodes or me? I said Valentine can be picturesque. Oh, Valentine. If you squint really hard, maybe. All right, let's slow up a bit. We're just gonna go Is through casual. I hate this place. <laughs> Ew. That's not even a step foot in that. I need... I'm gonna say hello. I'll be right back. Hmm? I'm gonna say hello to the saloon folk. You wanna say hello to the saloon folk? He does. Why? Because he likes Valentine, apparently. Give me like a moment. I won't be long. I need to buy a new canteen anyway. Well. I'm just gonna wait over here. There ain't a chance you're going to get off here. Than Valentine. Well, I figure there ain't a chance you're going to get off the horse anyhow. Stepping on this schmud. No, I'm quite alright. Let's 
road or this town wouldn't be that bad if it wasn't for all the schmud all in the middle. And all the strange people. Did you see that person in a a cat head? I'll see that person. They were creeping around the saloon. Mm. I won't yuck someone's yum, but for me, fur doesn't really do it. <laughs> Not to say I don't like a little bit of fur, but only of the natural kind. I may need to rest my head down soon. Getting very tired. Alright. I'll try to make it quick to show you all the plan. As long as you're not quick later. I won't be there. You wanna go Good. with the window rock? Are you gonna take your shirt off and sing lullabies? Maybe for you, not Red. I'll take it back. This place is all as hell. Yeah. All right. I told you so. Tiki Rawa. He, he was on. All right, never mind. We'll continue on. Oh, is Hold Red on. coming? Yeah, eventually. Oh, well, let's give her a moment. This wagon will, er, sorry, this plan will involve a wagon. Okay. Fair enough. Is that the, is that the fellow you're talking about standing on the outhouse over there? Um, what's your house? Oh, yeah, yeah, that, that's him. <laughs> yeah. Alrighty. Follow me. We'll head out this way. And we're not going to pick it up right now, but if we were, we would start doing it right here at this tree. So is this a, a getaway? Yes. Okay. I was very confused as to what we were actually doing. Mm -hmm. This would be the getaway plan. We would need six. We would need either four or six because it's a relay plan. Uh, well, I mean, Damien we'll take we'll left here. Oh, well, you said you offered the other one a spot. That one fella. I did. I did. Yes. I just need to tell him at some point. Although, uh... I wasn't very impressed by the way he went about trying to rob me. To well, this is why we're making the plans. We're gonna cut right here in between these two gray looking trees. Down the hill. Just... Gonna go to the right. We're gonna probably want to go single file through here at this point. As you can see, why? No, I can't. 
Mine we're going to stay percent. left. It may not single file. Just watch the rocks. This will be the trickiest part here. This this part right here is what's going to slow us up the most. Because of these rocks. I don't know if I remember any of this. You might have to just draw it on a map. Or just leave on the escape. I actually have drawn her on the map. You want to keep going here? Isn't this where you locked the moonshine wagon? Maybe. Yes. All right. Go ah, up. So that was the time. Mm -hmm. I've had you the worst uh, wagon driver, Lucas. All right. Right here in this spot right here. Let everybody get up here. We're going to have a big wagon right here, blocking this path with just a little space next to this rock for us to squeeze through. Only to move it by it, is what you're saying? Huh? I block it off? Is that what you're saying? Well, no, that would take too much time. My plan is, so we have, we'll get off our, no, we'll get off our horses right as we get to the wagon. We'll, we'll get off our horses there. It's going to be a relay. So the first, uh, everybody will get off their horses down there. And then, oh, we'll run through this section with this wagon blocked off here. We'll run through the little gap. The people who, who rode their horses the first leg are going to turn around. They're going to light up that gap right there to make sure they don't cross. While the second, uh, the ones who are riding on the back on the first leg whistle for their horses. Once they got their horses, mm. we stop firing, we get on their horses, and we take off. I see. I see. I went through the gap. And... Yeah, if they want to, if they want to get testy, we can use this as a spot to fire down. But ideally, we just want to be firing at this spot and make them not want to come through. I feel I like. I feel like it's gonna make things a lot worse though. If they do get through. Then we'll have, you know, we've shot. So at that point, it's it's they, they can shoot us back. Well, if the only. That's a good point. Well, so we were. That was my next qu uh, question. There was a circus wagon. That's big. That's only fifty uh, dollars to rent, but it has bars, so you could probably shoot through it. But there's a there's a bigger wagon that's like a hundred and fifty to rent. It's like the wagon that we stole earlier, uh, Sly, Sylvia, um, for the moonshine job we did. Hmm. Okay. That's one fifty to rent. But I mean, if anything, we could um, have two people who rode up uh, the first leg start firing while the third person comes up to these horses and detaches them, sending the wagon. It'll be uphill, so sending the wagon down further to close the gap. The biggest thing is we want the wagon right here so they can't climb around it. There's nothing to jump on. Like right here. You see this like it's too high for them to jump. Mm, you do have good ideas. I'll give you that. I'm willing to try it. If for some reason we have an odd amount of people, an idea that I had is have somebody give somebody a little bit of loot and somebody had to volunteer I mean I could volunteer I wouldn't care um, give somebody a little bit of loot and have them split off like the odd person out if we had odd numbers I, I think having one split off would be just fine basically they would get a what well, I, I don't know would law chase the one person or the big group who knows I, I think law would probably think that the one person's a distraction wouldn't go after them I don't think the, they would think the one person would have loot that's why we give them a little bit, so... I just know, at least in my past escapades, they have chosen to follow the one because they're superiorly outnumbered them. So, you know, the one is better than none idea. Right. That's why we only give the person a little bit of loot. So if they get away, you know, we keep something. If not... If, if they get cool, then we get more money. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Fair enough. I like at it. The, I like it. At the most, we need to make sure... At the very least, we need to make sure we get all the money out of the safes. The items, if they take it, it's one thing, but the money is the one thing they can't take. Yeah, fair enough. But at the very least, we need to make sure we get all the money out. 
It's not a bad idea, by any means. This one here. I think it would work. I don't think I, they'll I think be expecting. Yeah. I don't think they'll be expecting a wagon there. And by the time, I don't like, think if you expecting look, any sort of plane. If you look at the map, I mean, to get around that wagon, we'll be gone by the time we get back up here. Yeah, I think it's a good idea. I, I like leaving the wagon blocking it off. We almost did that on your uh, prison break. Unfortunately, Law almost killed the Rams a million. Right. In that way there. Uh, but a very similar idea of cutting them off there. I like the idea. Mm hmm we just got to have a little bit of space for us to squeeze through, and then we just open fire on that space. Not at them, but just at that space so they won't come through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I'm not trying to kill them. No. So I think just holding them back for a second while we hop on this second group's horses is... And, of fine. course, you know, they're going to... If they catch one of us, they're going to try to say that we shot at them. But technically, we shot at a rock. We didn't shoot at them. I'm okay with that. No, that's if they don't start shooting at us first. They might. Now, the only bad thing is they might shoot at us coming up here. They might think it's a funnel. Yeah, they might start shooting. Early. That's a good point. I thought but, about that earlier. Too. But once we get um, to that I, slope, we'll just dismount our horses. We'll run. We'll swerve back and forth. We'll... If we don't, if we don't get off before the like early, we should be fine. Because even if they do, we'll be through the hole. You know. Mm -hmm. I think we'll be okay. We just gotta... I think if they start shooting early, we just gotta resist the urge to shoot back at them and just rush up here. That's fun by me. Hey, the first thing should always be running from gunshots, right? Mm -hmm. I think... I, well, really I, think blood, so. I think in this case, if we turn and shoot, we're screwed because we have no cover. We, we, we're we better off just running through the gap. I agree. I agree. Hey, we aren't trying to get a stand up. We're trying to get away. Mm -hmm. It's my feeling. Right. I'm pretty sure I told... After? Um, afterwards, I mean, from here we could go to... We could loop back around... And go to Window Rock if we want to go up to Bacchus and cross back to, over the river. Uh, I think it just depends how fast they get through here. Um, if they're yeah. still following us, we can go to Window Rock and try to make some sort of sand. Or we can head back towards Emerald and get the rest of our horses. Well, here's the thing though. To get through it, they're going to have to get off their horse too. So if we're already on our horses, which the only reason we'll stop firing is to let everybody else get on the horse... I think, I think, okay, so I think the second leg of people, once they get on their horse, once they whistle the horse and get on them, they should take over the firing while the rest of us get on it, get on their horse. Yeah, I, I agree. The people on the horses should be firing while we uh, move back on. Let's be yeah. quicker that way. We'll just cha change turns. The first riders will, once we get right. through, we'll turn around and shoot until everybody, the second riders call their horses, and then we'll, we'll switch. So there's constant fire. By the time their fire stops, they'll have to get off their horses to come through, and they'll realize that we just rode away. As long as we don't come back in this area, I say we kind of we kind of I mean, do. Yeah, if we, we loop even, back in the opposite direction, we do a wide loop. We ain't even that far from Valentine. We could just leave two horses here. We don't need to waste. We could stage here. Ryan to Valentine, two on two. Leave horses here. Right. We ain't that far. Yeah, we could do that, and that's that's kind of the idea. I meant like as far as release the horses. I meant like release the horses from the wagon if we need to close the gap. Oh, I, I got you. But even I, I even then, you. I really, I kind of don't want to do that because then the wagon's stuck there for a while, and they'll have to get people to come. Yeah. Fair enough. All right. Anyway, it's a good idea. I think we can move on for now. So we just need to go to bed so we can take you to Window Rock. I do. Take you to Window Rock and... I saw Lucas and I got tired. Wow. I'll see you, Howard. You haven't missed me enough. Which way's better? 
I have, have to mission. roll this time. No, you haven't. Let's go this way. Let's go up and around. There's certain things I'm looking to remember. I have to give you my telegram before I go to sleep, just in case. Then you can write me love letters. Hope there's no trains. What's the worst that can happen? We got a splat. What can I say? I'm good with my mouth. like a deal to me. You'll just have to wait in line. So I'm afraid someone else got to me first. Hmm. But it's fine. I share. Monogamy is overrated anyway. Oh, I do like the look of this. Much better than the desert. Open this somewhere up here we can go up. I think I should have turned way back there. Get up there. Hold on. Can we get up here? Oh! Too steep. Too steep. That's oh, too geez, steep. Don't turn around like that. I didn't have a choice. I'll take you out next time. I di didn't have a choice to turn around. A horse did that. <laughs> what what it happened? It slid down. We get up here. Cool. Let's not try. I think Red is the only civilized person here. Oh, I'm very. He knows how to do things like riding horses. I don't know what you're referring to. I'm an expert. Okay, I'll be watching. <laughs> I like this already. You were right that there's buildings. Mm-hmm. Rest by buildings. Been good seeing you all. Nice yeah, nice reunion to see happening. Good to see you again. Try and be around tomorrow if I can, but uh, I can send some telegrams either way. Lucas, my telegram is. Go on. 
I was just giving you time to be ready. New York no. 848. The suspense wall is killing me. Alright, New York. No, I know. 848. There you go. Alright. I only give my telegrams to the good looking ones, so. I'll take that as a compliment. And as for you, I will be seeing you later. As do I. Sure will. Good night, everybody. Be safe. Don't do anything I wouldn't. Alright. Um, there's a couple things that I would like before we do a job. And that is one of those being somebody I would like a bank. We need to find somebody who would be willing to be our bank. See, that's a hard thing to do. Because we need to find someone we trust, and yet that also doesn't want to get involved. Right. Because if we give ourselves all our money to a bank, and they, you know, we don't trust them, they'll keep it. And they'll never fucking see him again. Mm-hmm. So it's a little bit of a balance there. Right. See, uh, it'd be, the, what I'm thinking is more so like a business deal. We find somebody who's, you know, kind of in a gray area when it comes to the law. Make them a business deal, you know. You hold our money for us, you keep 20% of whatever we deposit, you know. I might have met somebody two days ago mm -hmm. that might be willing. They actually run a business out here in the Crocs and uh, import export of Gorma. Ooh. Are they they may be willing to they... uh, hold their money for them. Are they around often? They seem to be. They're based out of St. Denis and Ansberg. So hmm. not really where we're around, but uh, we got along quite well, hard enough. It's an idea, anyway. If What's... we were to. Let's just say, quote unquote, invest in our business. He may be willing to hold it for us. Mm -hmm. I haven't broached the idea to her yet, but it seems. What's awesome. her name? I actually don't know. We never exchange names. <laughs> which okay. Is, but you which have is a great. telegram? But we, I do. I do. Okay. Maybe let's go back into a town and uh, reach out to her. Yeah. I, I kind of just want to organically cross paths with her again, if that makes sense. Oh, I see. I think it'll feel more... Where'd you say she works out of? Stand to me. She watched me uh, get robbed the other day, like I said. Oh. Well, attempted robbery. Like I said, I talked this man out of it and offered him a job. So. Hmm. Well, you think, Grelly? I think we should go to Saint Denis and see if she's around. Y'all are up for it? It looked like she was trying to expand her business. Potentially, it's a connection. I don't, I don't want to bet on it just yet. But uh, if we interact a few more times, I'd feel more willing to broach the idea. The only reason I... Uh... The only reason I say we need a bank is because I know Red has... Red, how much money you have in your hotel now? A thousand. Uh, she has a thousand. I have a couple hundred shy. I mean, there ain't you no way we're going to be able to store. I have none. And I'm not wanted, at least as far as I know. I can hold it for now. Well, I mean... At least temporarily. You you are wanted. They just don't know. They don't have a They name. just don't know who I am. Yeah. At least I don't think so. I, I you know. I don't, I don't know. tell them your name. No, I didn't wear a mask, but I also didn't send my name. So, who right. knows? If they're a student, though, they could put pieces together. But they so. I'm definitely, uh, I was telling them I'm definitely wanted, so. Oh, how come? Well, we, uh, we robbed the fella, um, a couple nights ago. And, um, 
he told us after we had robbed him that he was a deputy. Oh. Just robbed him of a handgun to use for the job. Okay. Well, that's, uh, yeah, unfortunate, I suppose. I mean, not like it would have stopped not me anyways, really. but it was just, you know. No, yeah. <laughs> it's just a little more time than I would have liked. A little heftier of a charge it's than really I would have liked. For you. Yeah. What a change shit for him. Luckily, I took the, uh, it's a good thing actually I didn't take the rifle, because I'm sure that would have been etched. He had a double action on him. So I took that instead. I gave him a choice like we usually do, rifle or handgun. And he said he'd rather keep the rifle because there was cougars. We were at McFarland's. Fair enough, our man. See if I can find this woman again. Yeah. I think we could maybe broker a deal. I think she's kind of desperate. She was hiring some real hotheads. Hmm. A part of it. Part. Of, a very small part. Now, what is her? Okay, so what is her business again? She runs imports and exports at a Gorma. Okay. But a part of me. Thoughts. Maybe we get ourselves hired on and rob the shipment. Oh, good. Seems like it'd be a lot of money in it, and we could, you know, lie low, do the job a few times, learn the in int intricacies of it, mm -hmm. and turn around and rob it the next time. That would kind of sour the bank deal, though. Well, with her, maybe. Yeah. But now I've been the law that if we, you know, sat, worked a few jobs, got paid, and then waited for a big one and robbed it, that's just opportunity there. It's not a terrible idea. No, I don't think it's a bad idea at all. In fact, I think it's a very fucking good idea. I did, um, another thing, I did tell the the deputy that we robbed um to take to make a note that we were going to be doing a job soon and that whenever we do this job we plan on taking no hostages and I told him to make a note that if their law if law tries anything to take advantage of that we'll make sure to bring a hostage to every job that's fair he seemed to actually, he seemed to like it. He said it resp he respected that. You know the name of this deputy? Ah, shoot. Red Bull. Last name was Cassidy. Yeah, first name's, that's, you know it's good you know the last names. I knew the first name. It's, uh, Emmett Cassidy then. Oh, but I know him. Never met that. He, he's recently transferred in, he said. Ah, uh, okay. It was just like his second day at the crossing. Yeah. He okay. said that... He said, actually, the robbery was going to be his first bit of paperwork he's ever done here. Oh. Well, call to learn experience and drop the charges. That's what I would say. <laughs> I can see how that negotiation would go. Oh, you know, just, you just, be like the, just be like you with know. the... Just be like with the... With the deputy, whoever's charging. is like, you know, I, I was doing y'all a favor and giving him experience writing paperwork. You should paperwork. really... You should really just drop the charge for the for the favor I did y'all. The learning opportunity. The good thing is though, I still don't think a lot of deputies know what I look like, so. Like not oh, enough not enough to like identify oh, I, I, me from a distance, you know what I mean? No. Actually I mean, we we passed by a lot of deputies earlier. The deputy who negotiated Great coat. I never knew his name. The one that was sitting there. Uh, was like gray coat. The that was that was Wiley. Was. I think it's, I think it's, I think it was Wiley. senior deputy Wiley. I think. He stood next to me and talked about him. Did not recognize me at all. So right. I don't trust their ability to recognize us too much. Quite. Well, they probably see a lot. 
probably see a lot of criminals in the day. You know, what makes you lost? And compared to a lot of the gangs around here, or you know, we're just bandits and thieves. We're not killers or anything that they're always chasing. I like being a little bit of a low priority tool, I guess. Right. Less difficult for us. Fun. No, it's only a benefit. You know. Mhm. Mm I like the idea of like, uh, you know, if there was if there was two gangs run run around the cross, and it was us, and then I don't know, uh, like a killer gang that just kills and kidnaps whoever they want. I like the idea that they would choose them over us. The chase. Roger being awful quiet. Just listening. What a weird looking tree. For that wagon, we'll have to make sure that we position it in a way where they can't shoot the horses. Well, I think leaving the horses there beforehand probably better if we can station them behind the wagon the whole time. Mm -hmm. Why not be on? Why not be? Anyway. I'm be honest, I, I don't know where I'm going. At this point. I thought you. I thought you had your map marked or something. It's been throwing me off this whole time. There's been like wolves and horses, like dogs and horses, like in this, in that ambiance video that I was playing. It's been throwing me off this whole time.
I don't even know where we are. Oh, I was trying to get to Annsburg. Uh, I think it's this way. Yeah, I'm sure it's somewhere around here. I think it. I've been just trying to go like directly. East Red, do you know? Um. It's not like across this water. I think. I think it is. Yeah, we got across. Okay. Luke, get this. We did a. It, I thought it was such good. Like, wait, is it this way? The other way. What? We should be going to the east. East. Yeah. Okay. East. Okay, that's this way. Yes. Um. I thought this was such a good uh, payout for this job. So we had, we had a job that was, fifty crates of fifteen moonshine. Okay. Uh. Dropped off to. What did I hit? Oh, what the frick? Am I the only one that didn't see this here? I heard that, you yell before I saw you fly. That's so, that's perfectly camouflaged. He, he did a couple of flips. <laughs> what did you hit? Uh, here, I'll show you. <laughs> the fact that you asked that makes you feel a lot more. You feel validated? Yes. <laughs> right? This is what I hit. Oh, Log. Uh, oh, what, what? Oh, it's a cannon? What is, oh, it's a tree branch. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Hold on. You ain't lying. Uh, I was going, well, so, from see, better this. horse knows how to a navigate. A little so more uh, airborne in there, but yeah, pretty much what he did. A few yeah, more tumbles, yes. flips, that like. I thought I could fly for a second. He was All head I over heels. Was, what the hell did I hit? And then I saw I saw you on the ground. I never really saw you hit anything. <laughs> Anyways. Packages at 15 to 3 drop-offs. And it was the payout was 187 per drop. 187? Yeah. Jesus. That's for good. It was like five hundred dollars. It's like five hundred dollars and some change. For three drop, yeah, that, that's that's very good. We were trying to just find some single deliveries for uh, Sylvia to get us some money, but we couldn't find any. So we're like, forget it. We're just gonna do what the? Where are we going? This way. Okay. I would also not have your rifle out, Red. You're about to start a whole shootout. Next place I'll check is standing telegram office. We can have next place. Alright. We could probably stake out the telegram office of the knee for a bit. I'll just, I'll just stop by the next couple of days, see if I run into her. Feels like a really good mm. connection to make. I just wish I would have got her name. <laughs> uh let's oh, check wow. the uh this is where the boat to Guarma is, isn't it? Maybe she might have That's a okay. poster somewhere. Oh, good point. Very good point. Yeah, let's go turn these styles around.
I didn't see nothing, which makes me doubt her validity in the first place. Sorry, just give me a second. Yeah, I did not see anything, which is. Wait, hold on. What's that? We're back. I'm gonna see what this is. Who was that guy? He just disappeared. In the world? <clears throat> Howdy, Charlie. Howdy. This man's hiding in the shadows. There he is. There he is. Howdy, fella. How are you? Doing all right. Not much yourself. I'm doing just fine. Do you think this? Do you think my friend here was a lawman? None in particular, no. Hmm. Saw the green Ooh. banjo over there. Who oh, looked that's... at me. He thought it was a. Thought it was a ranger. Yeah, that's... <laughs> ranger and a lawman. That's funny. Real <laughs> funny. We are, uh, anything but, I should say. Yeah. Fair enough. We are definitely not paperwork doers. That's what I'll, that's what I'll call medics, rangers, and law. Goddamn. So, brother. Ticks from dime to dime. Mm. Need to get that looked at. I don't know if I'm going to this or something. What happens, Don Hard? What's the name, friend, if you don't mind my asking? Kyle. Roe. Kyle. My well, pleasure to meet you. Name's Charlie. Pleasure, Charlie. What about the gun in my life? Lucas Malone, nice to meet you. Kyle Rowe, that's the name I'm perfect for. In a good way or a bad way? All sorts of ways. If it's a bad way, you would never heard of me, fella. I hate to break it to you. <laughs> well, then let's just say all good ways, then. I've heard that you are Maybe. a wanted man in more ways than one. Thanks, that's supposed to be. No, so. Well, got a reputation, one I respect. That's how so. As long as it's respectful, I guess. Uh, respectable. Oh, 
It is, trust me. You got a, uh, you got a crew you run with around here? Frag Gaiden. Frag. Like I've, it's not like I've heard of him. We're still, uh, still a little new around the cross, and so I'm still trying to get to know all the gangs and things. We also stick to our own lane. We try not to, uh, get in other gangs' ways or anything like that. None stand anymore. So what are y'all, like an up-and-coming posse or something? A group of friends? Yeah, well, you could say both, really. We, uh... We used to, uh, do most of our work out in Texas along the Panhandle. But, uh... Job went wrong, we had to split up, and we met back up here. There's currently five of us now. Not how many? How many of the group? Yeah. Uh, There's five of us right now. I mean, how many before? How many did we lose? Oh, 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 oh. Uh, I mean, I uh, I'd say maybe. about ten, including yeah. hangarounds. Yeah. Hangarounds don't really follow us here, though. Mm. I'm sure more will turn up eventually. Maybe one day. Not holding out hope, but you never know. That's fair. Any place y'all stay in particular? Uh, out we west. Got a yeah. Yeah. Out west, we uh tend to hang around Ratsko, or how east we'll hang around Window Rock and such. Uh, Just depends where we. Uh... That, uh... So yeah. Let's go by new that on around Rathskiller with the De Lobos. Santi was his name, Santiago. Mm. I Pretty good seen place. It. Yeah, it is a it is a really nice place. That I haven't seen any De Lobos. I saw I've the memorial. Yeah. Uh, the yeah, Lobo the Rock. Lobo. Yeah. Yeah, there were like three, four different generation of De Lobos. Latest was about four, seven months ago. You must have been around a long Six, time seven. then. You know Something that. Like that. January 18, 1902. Yeah. That's a, that's a good amount of time. Well, yeah. if you all are inhabiting some place in the West, we'd love to talk a little bit more whenever we get the chance. This is 092 is my telegram. Say that one more time for me. SS092. Alright. I'll reach out then. Sounds good to me. Well, uh... I don't know about Lucas here, but I'm gonna go make sure our other friend around here didn't get herself caught. I see her right now. You mean the one standing behind us? No, she's all the way over there. Over. Nice to meet you. Pleasure, you motherfuckers. Have a good night. I know that name, Kyle Rowe. I don't know. I started drinking with some love and trying to get information out of him. Mm. That was the name that kept coming up constantly that day. Interesting. Frey Gang sounds familiar to me, not Kyle Rowe. I ran over the leader of the Frey Gang. Oh. Um, yeah. <laughs> he might have been there. I, I don't know. She get off to. She was just. Probably here. sitting somewhere above. Oh, she's. No, I thought mm -hmm. she was one of the, the 
boxes brought by us, but I... No. When I got a closer look, it wasn't her. Yeah, Red doesn't have... Contrary to what you would think, Red doesn't have red hair. No, so, no, no, you're right. I, 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 just, she go? I didn't really look at who it was. Is that her horse in front of us? No, she wants a black horse. I know. Oh, no, that's a... Okay, that's more brown, I guess. Oh, here she comes oh, here, though. here she is, here she is. E Roman? I was watching people scatter like oh. ants. It's mm. Greek, actually. You what? You said Greek? You said Roman. Ah, oh, oh, I see. Mm. Uh -huh. dead is a, that, that's dumb. I apologize. Uh, let's go. I guess we go to San Denis and see if we can find this lady, this mysterious lady. I just want to see who that was. Got to gas, though. Well, you could have. You didn't have to leave the conversation. That? I just said I was going to go look for Red to make sure she wasn't. Oh, no, no, no. That, that was enough. That was a long enough conversation. Yeah, it was starting to get awkward. There's like awkward pauses in there. No, I, I was ready to leave a few minutes earlier. <laughs> you want to leave them, want them more, you know? Uh, right. Yeah. I'm, 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 sub I'm curious to what they would want to talk about. I don't think they need folk out west. I'm gonna take the tracks here. Yeah. And I need a moment to myself when I get to town. Mm -hmm. Might be getting close to time for me to I might lay my head down here soon. No, that's that's fine. Yeah. You're, You're going back to Window Rock. Out. Yes, I'm going back to Window Rock. I can do this alone if you want. I don't mind. No, no, no. I mean, I want, I'm curious to see who this person is. I just don't know if they're going to be here or not. I figure we'll wait around a bit. I mean, people will come up to the telegram station here all the time. Oh, Lord. Who's this? Okay. Oh, Jesus. There was a snake there. On the other side. Uh oh, fuck. Okay. Sorry. Howdy. Hey. 
People go up on the side of it. Right away. You don't see that too often. I'm gonna find an outhouse. I'll be right back. Ah. Oh, look at that. Strange. Thank you. 
Wow, wow, really? Really? Lucas is right there. What? Least fucking subtle people have seen my goddamn life. We weren't trying to be subtle. You could. You're succeeding. We were just over there to get out of the rain. Fair enough. Wait, I don't know what you don't want to do. Right? I can stick around if I need to. Ready? You want to stick around for a bit? I think I'll go lay my head down. Honestly. Yeah. Tell them. You don't want to pretend to rob me? Why? Why? I'm not getting them two to come around and console me after. A good introduction that one. Mm. 
You know, I don't I don't really want you in double barrel. Oh yeah. I can just put my hands on and say, please no, God no, please no. Oh my god, no. Uh, oh, if, can just run if, out you, of here. if you want to say that, just go back with Charlie, you know, him and um Oh, his... okay. I don't want to hear that, okay. Red Stop <laughs> <laughs> saying do I need to go full name on you? I don't want to hear. I don't want to hear what goes through your mind about what happens in Wendell Rock. Okay. Well, you just said you didn't. You wanted to say, "God, no, please, no." <laughs> There's your opportunity to go say it. Oh, I say that. I'm thinking about to say that nightly. Okay. Don't make me relive it now. <laughs> I don't want to live that now. <laughs> and trust me, I'll be saying it a lot in the future. Okay, let me save it for then. <laughs> All right, I'm going to sleep. Well, sure? not really. Freaking move out the way, why don't you? Turn on some freaking tunes.
Mm, nah. Oh boy. Good leaving. 